everyone, this is Cricket Song with Lunar Wisdom. And today I wanted to address a comment that I made in a previous video. I believe it was the video where I'm talking about, it was like the conversation continued about Christian Wicca. I think that's the title of it. And it's where I'm um, talking about one of my subscribers who wanted, believed that they were a Christian Wiccan and they were trying to find a way to make that work. And they were talking about looking at the polarities of masculine and feminine and trying to figure out a different way to make that work for them because they really didn't feel drawn to the feminine goddess. In the video, the second video, I talk about or I make a comment about how God and Satan are basically the same. They're one and the same. And I got a lot of individual subscribers and comments, well, comments and emails and messages from subscribers saying that how could that be they were Wiccan, Pagan, a witch, and they didn't they didn't believe in the devil or Satan. So, and if I'm Wiccan, how could I also say that because there is no Satan or devil in Wicca? So I wanted to get a little more in depth with what I meant when I said that. Now, number one, I want to let you all know that this is my personal view and only my personal view. I do not speak for anybody else. And I do not feel that I have the one truth. So if what I say does not ring true for you, then throw it out and move on. Disregard it. But this is how I view it. And this is why I've said what I said and believe what I do. I'm going to start by asking a couple of questions so you can see where I'm coming from. As a Wiccan, understand that I am an eclectic Wiccan, so it does mean that my basic beliefs stem from Wicca. However, I do pull from other religious and spiritual paths to forge my own truth, and I encourage everyone to do the same, no matter where you're coming from whether you're Christian, whether you're Wiccan, whether you're pagan in general, whether you're whatever it is you are. Okay. My first question for you is how do you view deity? God, the divine, the source of all that is. How do you view deity? Do you view it as transcendent, meaning meaning all-knowing and, and sort of above, as above? Do you view deity as imminent, meaning within everything, within me, within all, as within? So do you believe or view deity to be above or within? Or do you view deity as being both transcendent and imminent, meaning that deity is above and, and like within us as well as above us or without us, within and without, above and below. How do you view deity? I choose the word manifest. I view deity as manifest, meaning that I also, I view deity as transcendent and imminent. Deity is manifest within everything, meaning that deity is this energy that is within everything and makes everything. You cannot separate deity from anything because everything is deity. So for me, the goddess and the god are in and of everything. They are transcendent and imminent and manifest. So taking this view of what deity is, I understand for me that deity has both polarities within because deity is everything. 
everything is deity and ev deity is everything. Which means all the positive things that you would call positive and all the negative things that you or I might label as negative, including happiness and sadness, the day and the night, the feminine and the masculine, the physical and the spiritual, up and down, in and out, both come from deity, which then, if you take the next step, means that good and bad and good and evil or those things that we would label as such originate with deity because again deity is everything and everything is deity hence god and devil are deity they are of the same thing now this does not mean that I choose to focus my attention on Satan, the devil. This doesn't mean that I choose to worship and honor the devil. I do not choose to do so. There are others that may. Personally, I do not choose to focus or worship or honor those things that Satan the devil represent. This does not mean that I do not believe that there is a devil. In fact, for me, although this is getting into a whole different video, I'm just going to say that I believe that once you label something, it exists. But that's a whole nother video, so we're not going to go into that at this moment. But saying that this doesn't mean that I don't believe that there is something called Satan the devil out there it just means that I choose not to focus on it or honor that or worship that but I realize it's there because again everything comes from deity deity is within everything and that means that deity is within the things that I may choose not to desire for my own life experience such as the devil. I don't desire to experience the devil and all its forces in my experience, but it doesn't mean that I don't acknowledge that it exists. And that is why I said what I said, because I believe everything. This cup is of deity. I am of deity. This chair, the camera, my bracelets, everything, my feelings, my love, my disappointment, all that is from deity because it all originates with the same energy. That's what I meant by saying <clears throat> that God and Satan are one in deity. Hopefully that explains a little more. Okay. And again, if you choose not to agree with me, I am open to that because I understand that not everybody follows the same path. And I would not expect everybody to follow the same path. And I honor your choices as much as I honor mine. And I love you all. Thank you for watching. Mwah.